What is going on, my average gamer? Superman Ryan here, and today, ladies and gentlemen, today we are back with some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links, and today we are going to be doing some more PvP ranked matches on our road to the King of Games. As you can see, here in the gold rank one tier, and uh, I plan on getting up a little higher than that today. Today, this is the deck that we're going to be running. It's a new deck that I've created. Uh, working out pretty freaking fantastic it centers around <clears throat> this mr bad boy right here relinquished and meteor black ragged it's pretty similar to the last deck that i was using in the last few videos uh, but there are a few changes i took out a lot of the luminous dark witches and and uh jerry beans man stuff like that and i just threw in uh, other monsters. I still have Sonic Bird and Syndra of a Thousand Hands specifically to get out that Relinquish. I do now have Blue Dragon Summoner because I have two Red Eyes Black Dragons and two Meteor Black Dragons in here. So I'm more likely to draw one of them really early on into the game. Uh, and then Blue Dragon Summoner is going to help me get the other one so that I can fuse them together to summon that Meteor Black Dragon. Um, I also have Black Dragon's Chick because if I draw a Red Eyes Black Dragon uh, and I don't have a Polymerization yet, I can summon that Red Eyes Black or that Black Dragon's Chick. Use its effect. You can send this face up card you control to the graveyard. Special summon one Red Eyes Black Dragon from your hand, and that can be done the same turn that I summon Black Dragon's Chick. So if I draw both those cards on my first turn, I can summon that Black Dragon Chick, activate his effect, and special summon Red Eyes Black Dragon on turn one. I do have two Mirage Dragons, and I only have two in here because I only have two of them. Otherwise, I would put a third one in here. Your opponent cannot activate trap cards during the battle phase. That is a very, very clutch effect, especially here in the, uh, the ranked PvP match setting. Uh, especially when I have peak performance as my skill because it's going to go up to an 18 attack monster with that effect. I do have double summon in here because <laughs> it's always nice to get two monsters out on the field in one turn. And then obviously mirror wall, reinforcements, and metal morph just for those added defensive buffs. Now, ladies and gentlemen, uh, again, if you have not seen the first few videos of this road to the king of games in this new season. Um, I said that I'm going to use the same deck until I get ranked down with it. Well, it that doesn't mean I'm going to use the same deck until I lose and then I'll change decks. I'm going to use the same deck until that deck gets me ranked down. This deck has not gotten me ranked down. I've lost a couple of matches. I do get some pretty bad hands sometimes. Some pretty bad starting hands. Um, but for the most part this deck has been pretty clutch. It has been pretty clutch. We are going up against another Seto Kaiba. It looks like he's going to be using the skill um, beat down more than likely. Who's going first? He's going first. That's good because that means that I get to draw. Uh, ooh, Kaiba Man. Oh, man. And he's summoning Blue Eyes turn one. He's summoning Blue Eyes. Turn one. Where is my double summon? If I can pull a double summon right now, we've got this game unlocked. If I can pull a double summon right now, we've got this game locked down. Don't, but we do draw a metal more. So I'm going to go ahead and summon Sonic Bird here in attack position. And I activate his effect. Going to get the Dark Illusion Ritual from my deck, add it to my hand. I really wish I had a double summon so I could have summoned Senju, summoned Relinquished, took his blue eyes, and then just went in for the kill. Then I'm going to throw two cards face down. Now I'm set with a dilemma here. Excuse me for my voice and everything, too. My allergies freaking horrible. I am set with a dilemma here, though. If I use Mirror Wall when he attacks me with blue eyes, they're going to crash. It's going to cut his attack points in half, and they're going to crash. If I don't, then uh, I can summon Relinquish next turn, take him, and we'll be Gucci. 
Kaiser Seahorse. So he's wanting to summon another Blue Eyes. Oh, and Ririoku. Ah. Uh, that kind of... Now I have to... I have to use... Um, Mirwall. If I don't use Mirwall now, then I lose. Lay waste to your enemy. Lay waste to your enemy. Twelve hundred, yeah, no, we'll live. We'll live. It'll be extremely close, but we'll live. Can I pull a double summon? If I can pull a double summon, summon Sinju of a thousand hands, and then also summon um my Mirage Dragon, and then get uh relinquished out on the field. That would be. Amazing. Don't we draw Juminous Dark Witch? Um, Jew of a thousand hands. Now, the face down cards really got me kind of worried. Depending, no. Depending on what that face down card is, I could be really screwed. Or I could not. We will just have to see. I am going to get rid of. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of Duminous Dark Witch. I don't. I want to keep Sinju on the field just so that I can use him to attack his life points this turn. Um, and I do not want to get rid of. Mirage Dragon. Because I want to be able to use his effect. What do you have? Guys gotta have mirror wall face down. Gotta have mirror wall face down. Activate his effect. Now the one good thing about having, if he does have mirror wall face down, I have metal morph face down. So while he's gonna cut my attack points in half, I'm still going to cut his attack points in half, or at least add them to my life points. And then we're gonna go. I'm not gonna play around Windstorm because I don't think that it's gonna be Windstorm. I attack with a monster. Obviously, he doesn't have a Sphere Karibo in hand. The only thing that could really save him right now is an Econ or Mirror Wall. My trap activates. I activate that, equip it to Relinquish. 4,100. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. And he only has one card on the field. That's what's great about this right now. Is he only has one card on the field. No cards in hand. 150 life points. I mean, that's... that's how do you come back from that? How do you come back from that? I mean, you could draw Sphere Karibo. But I have two monsters. You could draw a trap card that'll help. Don't summon ooh, blue dragon summoner and then econ. So he's gonna steal my monster and then he's going to attack. Oh man, that might that might just have brought him back. That might have just brought him back. Relinquish still has metal morph equipped to him. I think I lose. I think I lose. I think that's the one play. I think that that is the one play that he had. 4,000. Yep. Man, that was... It was good. I mean... There wasn't anything I could do about that. I really thought that I had that match locked and ready. Obviously, I did not. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's a good deck. I need to get a Kaiba Man. I don't think I've ever seen a Kaiba Man in the shop, though, in the card trader. I don't, I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> I, re I really just don't know what to say about that. Starting duel.
what was that that was a 10 minute duel i mean that wasn't a bad a bad time frame for that duel but i really want to get us ranked up today son another kaiba are we gonna see another freaking blue eyes deck I'll tell you what, since the new cards came out, um, Dragon decks have gotten, I mean, they've, they've gotten a nice little boost. Barrage Dragon, I don't remember what the other dragon is, but he's, I think he counts as tributes or something, I don't remember. Can I draw a Red-Eyes Black Dragon this turn? That's the question. That's the question. Can I draw a Red-Eyes Black Dragon this turn? Some a meteor dragon. I mean, that's uh, fuck it. We'll summon Duminous Dark Witch in attack mode. I summon a monster in attack position. We'll activate double summon. From my hand, I activate a spell. And then we'll summon meteor dragon. We're gonna take him up to a two thousand attack monster. Twenty. 2200 defense, I think. Yeah. We'll throw reinforcements face down just in case. Go in. We'll go in. Got something face down. I don't know what it is, but he's got something face down. And of course, I attack into the Yomi ship. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I do not see Yomi ships very much at all anymore so I just oh man I can't believe I fell for that can I draw a red eyes now though now I really need a red eyes or blue dragon summoner Ooh, no monster cards face down polymerization it's not gonna help me in the slightest I don't want to throw polymerization face down just I'm going to end my turn. I don't want to throw Polymerization face down to fake him out or anything. If he, if he activates D spell or something to try to see what it is, he's going to destroy it. That's the only Polymerization I have in this deck. Okay, three cards face down and he's ending his turn. What kind of deck is this dude running? Relinquished. Nothing. Nothing good. Nothing. I'm getting crap right now. I'm getting absolute trash. Trying to show off the power of this deck, but I just... It's not letting me. And here is Kaiba Man. Here is a Kaiba Man. Can we draw a Black Illusionist? We are back, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry, we had some technical difficulties there for just a swift second. 3,200 attack. Uh, why am I seeing so many Kaibas this high up the ladder today? Man, I've never seen so many Kaibas before. And I've been using this deck all week. This deck might actually get us ranked down now. I'm it's gonna drive me up a wall if this deck gets us ranked down now. I know it's not gonna be this duel. Ooh. Sonic Bird here in attack position. That may have won us the duel, depending on what his face down cards are. No, oh, gosh, damn it. I don't want to activate that. Depending on what his face down cards are, we may have just won the duel. But I don't know. He, he could have a magic jammer face down or a magic drain. For all I know. I mean, I guess if he has magic drain, it won't really matter. I'm going to get rid of a red eyes black dragon chick. We're gonna summon relinquish an attack point in a in a, in a <coughs> attack position, boys. I'll play this. I ritual summon a monster. He's got something. It's gotta be mirror wall or econ. He's gotta have mirror wall or econ face down. Gotta be one of those. Yeah. What's it's got to be either Mirror Wall or Econ face down. I really wish I had. Whoa! It's 
got to be either Mirror Wall or or uh, or uh, or uh, or uh, Econ. I would almost rather be Mirror Wall. Enchanted Javelin, is that what that is? No, it's Windstorm. Windstorm. Okay. I'm okay with that. Honestly, I'm really okay with that. Because I still have the 3,000 attack monster on the field. Which now has 2,500 defense. Uh, and now my Sonic Bird is in defense position. So unless he summons a Trampler or something that does piercing damage, he's not going to be able to take me out this turn. <laughs> I draw. Are you more? What are you gonna do though? You're ending your turn. You're ending your turn. Give me Mirage Dragon. Ah, oh, Meteor Dragon. Not what I want. Where are all my freaking red eyes? Is though, yo. I'm going to keep Sonic Duck in defense position. We're going to go in for the attack. My monster attacks your life points. Oh, my freaking allergies. They make my nose itch. You know, runny nose. You runny nose. Ugh. Ugh. Enemy controller. Okay, that's what I thought. Enter the code. Enter the code. A, Left, right, A, B. Shut the... I end my turn. <laughs> my turn. Find me. <laughs> I draw. Okay, what do you got? Yeah, we're kind of just at a standstill now. I mean, unless he summons another blue eyes white dragon, which even if he does that, he really can't attack my relinquish, because if he does. Uh, one, he's going to lose life points, just like I will. And two, I'm just going to take his other blue eyes. And if my relinquish is in attack position, I'm going to activate reinforcements or metal morph. And, uh, be, be a wrap, son. The only thing... That I could really think that would guarantee him a win. Is if he mirror walls me. And then summons a blue eyes. Keeps mirror wall on the field. Which is not going to happen now. Because he only has a thousand life points. Oh. Because it doesn't matter. I mean if he could special summon more than one monster. Get blue eyes out on the field. Special summon another monster. And then um. Do like the like the guy the last duel did and just econ me, take my relinquish and attack me like that. Oh well, then then he's got the game lock and key, but Brawl sense high level. So he's gotta have a Kaiba man in his hand. It's gotta be a Kaiba man. But again, does it really matter? Ritual spell. Okay. How many stars? Four more, okay. Getting rid of a blue eyes, but I think he can special summon a blue eyes from his graveyard. I want to say that you could special summon a blue eyes with your graveyard with uh, the white paladin. White dragon paladin, whatever his fucking name. Paladin of white dragon. You can tribute this card special one blue eyes from your deck, but blue eyes white dragons cannot attack for the rest of this turn. So no, he actually can't. Summon one from his deck, if he has one in his deck. What he's going to do. He's going to do. But again, how does that help you? How does that... I have something stuck to the bottom of my foot. Sticker. Sticker for my kids. How does that help you? Though? You can attack me. Take my life points down. But unless you have like a Ryoku, I mean, Metal Morph... Metal Morph would help you win the duel. I mean, you could keep Blue Eyes in attack position, and I technically couldn't get over him. He's just going to end his turn. Yeah, I knew I should have Metal Morph. Yeah. 
And there is the Mirage Dragon. Your opponent cannot activate traps. We win. We win. Unless he has an Econ face down, we legit win. As a matter of fact, I'm going to throw Metal Morph face down. Just in case. And he's got to activate something right now. And he didn't. He did not. We win. Here's my face down card. See, I knew this deck was good. I knew this deck was good. You just gotta get the right freaking cards. There goes his blue eyes. The stool actually is over, Kaiba. It actually is. Uh, cause you can't, you cannot come back from that. But, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this video. As always, if you're new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button. Be very, very appreciated. Join the average gaming army. If you like this video, you want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links, Road to the King of Games videos, consider hitting that like button. Show your support. Remember, the more you support these series, the more they will come to the channel. But that is going to be it for this video, guys. As always, I want you to have a very, very beautiful day. And remember to keep it Gucci. Peace.